Electric vehicles. Let's talk about it. How much did you spend on your last fill up? I, I don't spend over 75. I, I stop it at 75 yeah. no matter what, but it, we're looking at about 140 to fill. I think around 80 dollars, yeah. I think. Uh, I think we're getting close to 70 now. It's a small, it's a compact SUV though, yeah. so it's a smaller one. Over a hundred dollars for yeah. the first time. Like, and it wasn't even empty. It was, I think, $108. Woo! Uh, last one was around 85 bucks. Do you like the idea of electric vehicles? Yeah. I mean, we live in Alberta, so it's, a, it's an interesting polarizing thing. Right. When I say it, what are your thoughts? I'm all for electric vehicles. Really, why? Yeah, uh, well, I'm, I'm big on lessening the impact on the environment for me. Um, and sustainable resourcing and things like that. So it just, to me, it's the obvious choice. It's just unfortunate that it is such a jump to get into an elect electric vehicle price wise. Uh, I like them. I All I know is that they save the environment a little more. I think it's fantastic. I think more people need to try it and have more confidence in it. Like, I think just for me, the power component makes me feel that just better. It's It's, Plug it in and hit it and not worry about the gas station. I think they're a good thing moving forward. I think it's something that we all need to consider. I also think that we have some work to do to get the distribution and the electrical systems in place so we can actually do this properly. Hopefully like everyone can get one because like like gas cars are pretty bad for the environment. And like if the ozone layer gets too thin then we get all like cooked to death. It's pretty morbid, but I like your thoughts. <laughs> I think they are interesting. I don't know if they are the future. I see some pros and cons, and I haven't looked into it deep enough for the cons, but um, you know, you can look at the mining of the resources to make the batteries. I don't know the ins and outs of that, but <laughs> is it really environmentally friendly? Yeah. I don't know. I drive a hybrid, already two hybrids. Uh, this is the future now. Yeah. It already is. Holy um, you know, we cannot continue on the path we are. Like fossil fuels are great, and I, I have a great standard of living. A lot of people have a great standard standard of living. Uh, the people in the oil and gas sector, they've done awesome work over the last century to get us to this point. But now there's a transition underway. I really value the work they've done, but the transition's underway. We have to. My son is here, along with his girlfriend, and I. I got quite emotional about this. This is for their future. Do you think the first vehicle you'll buy will be an electric vehicle? Depending on how much they have when I grow up. Yeah. We've, we've honestly talked, yes, about moving in that direction. So that's, that's definitely, Travis has a huge interest in that. And I, I kind of leave those decisions to him when it comes to a vehicle. <laughs> I'm like, I like, like, I'll pick the color. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, no, for sure. That's definitely, definitely cool. something that we're talking about in our household. I hadn't. I mean, in terms of electric versus gas, just always thought it was unaffordable. Thinking the Tesla and okay, that's sort of out of my league, but this being a Mustang, yes please. <laughs> Holy, like my stomach <laughs> is in my throat and the power off the start, amazing. Yes, for sure. Will your next vehicle be electric? Hopefully, I think, or hybrid at or the hybrid very least, at the very least.